Tonight we travel a path from abuse to true success. And in between there are crossroads that led to drugs, gangs, and gunfights. A Providence CEO took that journey and he shared his experience with Eyewitness News reporter Walt Buteau. He has tonight's street story, New at Six. Michael Cooley was abused as a child and then abused himself as a young adult until he tells us he hit rock bottom. When I came on board, what we did was embraced technology. He is no doubt the CEO of Providence record storage giant, the Quinlan Companies. Right. But look closer and you'll spot the gang tattoo on his wrist and the knife cut scars on his hand. Do you look back and think you could have died? Uh, again and again and again. He was a homeless teenager living in snow-covered St. Louis alleys. I would be in fights and those kind of things would happen, guns, knives. He eventually made a gang his family. And they start shooting rifles at the back of the car. The bullets would have hit me in the back, but they just stopped short of hitting me there. Being in the middle of crime scenes and drug deals didn't get old until Cooley was about 27. That's when he tells us instead of taking that destructive path he knew, he chose the other route. He's convert. He route. toured us through the company he now runs and reflected on how hard it was to put difficult memories on paper. I've been told by my stepmom and my mother that I should have never been born, that I would never amount to anything, that I would be a loser for the rest of my life. Now he hopes his words can guide. That there are other kids out there that just didn't have the parents to do this. They just didn't have the upbringing to do this. They didn't see the signs or they don't see the crossroads and they keep going down a path they know. He fully understands that whether that path took them to the training school or left them hapless in Providence, most will not become CEOs. I just want to help people know that whatever success is to them, there is a recipe that you could get closer to what you want. Success is whatever you define it to be. He is sharing his story with local schools and other groups face to face and with his book. Find out more, log on to our website and we'll link you to that information. Walt Buteau, Eyewitness News.